And we have uh, poly chunks of Team Butterfly in the red corner. Come up, please. And Tanzila Raza of Team Ali in the blue corner. So here we go. This uh, is uh, Tanzila Raza who will fight Poli Chong Su. And this is a light flyweight bout. Girls boxing. So we had a wonderful start. Where we saw Lokimi Navusese and Meli Abunimasi light up the stage. Now it's the turn for the girls to see what they can bring to this one. And this is uh, Poli Chong Su. Good to see uh, girls coming through in boxing and uh, great to see that uh, the pathway, we talk about pathway, this is really the pathway. You're giving boxers that opportunity to come and showcase themselves, to come and fight in front of a crowd and build themselves up. There are some eliminators when, you go, when we go into the professional grade and we can talk about that later, but uh, this is a great stepping stone uh, to fight in front of a crowd, to fight in, in a lovely setting, uh, in, a, in a wonderful backdrop for young girls and young boys. You know, that's right, Satish. Uh, one thing that Winston had always uh, talked about when he set this whole promotions uh, company up together was he wanted to, to create a, a, an atmosphere where our fighters could come and fight on this grand stage. So if they were to go abroad and fight, they would not be afraid of the big lights, the crowd, the atmosphere. We create it here, we create the pathway here, so their transition to fighting overseas would be pretty gradual and it won't affect them too much uh, mentally. Now these two females, uh, these two young girls, they come from uh, boxing pedigree. Uh, Chong Shu fights fights out of Butterfly uh, Club, which is uh, the Kolitapa uh, dynasty. Um, Mere Kolitapa is uh, her, her cousin, I believe. And you got Tanjila Raza, who also featured in the last uh, homecoming tournament. She is daughter of Junior Farzan Ali. So. There's a lot riding on this. Uh, these two girls, uh, whoever wins this, at least claim to bra bragging rights. That's wonderful, you know, to see that, uh, you know, your father is a, a household name as far as boxing goes. Your whole family, your uh, um, late uncle Zulfikar Joy Ali, and your father Farzan, and now the daughter steps up and takes her place in the centre of the ring. Tanzila Raza. in red to uh, fight Poli Chong Su in blue. No, uh, uh, it's the other way around, right? Way around. It's yep. the other way around. The other so way they've around. switched it. They switched it. So Raza in blue and Chong Su in red. Yep, you'll see Chong Su will definitely press the fight. She's uh, in a, Their style of fighting is very uh, aggressive. Whereas uh, Tanzila, they're always good on the back foot. The Ali style of fighting. Uh, sometimes it works, sometimes it doesn't, but in amateur, you know, points count. Uh, you've got to get be as on much the front points. foot, right? Yep, yep. Being on the front foot uh, definitely is an advantage. So that should favor Chong Su. Let's see. Got left that time. Chong Su getting it through. Yep, she's working off the jab. She's got a very straight jab. You'll see it. There you go. You, you'll see her straight jab. It's just she doesn't telegraph it too much. See that. Whereas uh, Tanzila, she telegraphs her moves. Um, it may it may contribute to the outcome of this fight. Three rounds, two minutes each. Chong Su goes to work on the body. Some combinations there, but not sure about the sting in those punches doesn't seem to have troubled Raza at all both these, uh, both these young girls are very energetic so uh, it's just uh, again you'll see uh, Chong Su work in the body she's trying to slow down uh, Raza from moving about too much Chong Su looks composed
Tanzil is always uh, good at showboating. She's a very confident, very, very confident young uh, female amateur fighter. Shows with the movement. Yep. Even though she's on the back foot, don't, don't get it wrong, she's on the back foot, but that's to her advantage. She works off the back foot. So great to see that uh, two females there. So she's got uh, corner woman. Corner woman, yes, yes. that's right. That's yep. great for boxing in this country. Yes, sir. We haven't seen that for a while. That's true. You know, a lot of people would say if uh, they can do it in rugby and do the Fijian and Bruin, they can do it in football and they can do it on all, in all other sports, why not boxing? And uh, here's some great uh, pathway towards that. That's right, Satish. So there's, there's one, as the camera span between the two, you'll notice one thing. Uh, Tanzila still oozes in confidence. She does not show any sign of uh, fatigue. She's ready to go. She didn't even take seat, mate. She didn't even take a seat. Yeah. Chong Su, if I may be wrong, no. might be wrong, maybe right. She, there was a bit of heavy breathing in the corner, but uh, they're all oh, back straight with a straight left. Chong Su's uh, jabs are definitely scoring points. Tanzila off the back foot just scored a good uh, counter. Outstanding eight count there for uh, Tanzila. So Chong Su has the edge in this one. Another lift works very Ooh. well. Chong Su's uh, jab is rocket straight and you just do not know when she's going to throw the right which uh, follows up right after it. Beautiful combination. There you go again, another scoring point. So Tanzila needs to, uh, she needs to capitalize on this. She needs to get the points uh, accumulated right now. You're in that one minute left of round two. I think Chong Su's got better combination. She's works, she works well with that left jab and then you know, that right straight that time. Tanzila's on the back foot, like you said, yeah, she holds back. You know, she hit the opportunity there, but uh, you know, she, she doesn't fire with the shots. That's right. Uh, unlike her dad, who was brilliant on the back foot, he, could, uh, he, was, he was always good on, on, on the turning his defense into offense. Um, Tanjil is still young. She has a lot to a lot to learn. But I can see she's uh, with that type of training. She, it's a bit difficult for her because you have someone like Chong Su who's always aggressive, always um, you know a juggernaut. You've got to learn to score points on the back foot. But Satish, this could this could um, this could play into into Tanjila's advantage where she could outpace uh, Chong Su. Chong Su could outpace herself, could get tied in the third and final round. Yeah, a lot to see in the third and final round. Chong Su certainly ahead on my card at the moment. Uh, but let's see what uh, Tanzila has got to show in the third and final round. She needs to pick up a game. She needs to come fighting better from uh, that back foot stands that she's taking but chong su she's done well she's landed some straight left jabs that uh, have certainly scored uh, for herself and uh, she also put tanzila to a standing eight count so that would have given her the extra edge heading into this final round two more minutes two more minutes to decide Here we go. Tanzila couldn't pick that up that time, but Chong Su again with that left leading, and that's great work. 
attacking. Chongsu working hard. So now it's just a matter of uh, getting the last points. Uh, I think Chongsu knows that she's got it in the bag, but she shouldn't uh, be too sloppy. She could get caught. You know, with boxing, anything can happen. Um, Tanzilla still on the back foot. So I think the power and that, that uh, left uh, jabs of uh, Chong Su have been a trouble for Tanzilla right throughout. And she still hasn't uh, worked out a plan to counter that. She's again on the back foot, but yep. no, no firecrackers from her. So it's difficult. She's waiting. We run to the last 35 seconds. Uh, so proud of these young girls, giving it all. Good right hand that time from Chong Su. Those body shots would definitely uh, add up. Another straight jab. Chong Su is very good at uh, throwing from the outside and then getting out quickly. Brilliant show. Good to see girls step up in this sport and fight. And the camera is on the girl that uh, I'm sure they know has taken this out. Chong Su and Tanzila worked very hard from that corner. Well done, ladies. Well done. Polly Chong Su certainly with more coaching, more training. And if she stays in this sport, she certainly can uh, build a name for herself in uh, this game. And Tanzella, well, she's got a very supportive family. So uh, she can only get better from here if she keeps on. That's right, Satish. As we await the uh, final decision, unanimous points decision. So that's uh, one by Polly Chong Su, unanimous points decision. And again, wonderful to sponsors, Sports World Fiji. They are giving prizes for amateur boxers and amateur boxing you can't take money so uh, <laughs> you uh, give them uh, prizes token of appreciation so there's some gift uh, packs and uh, medals for uh, the two fighters great yes. work oh and there's also sparks shoes Well done to these uh, young girls.